Hello, we have another parcel, and um, just by guessing, I'm guessing this one's from Radek. Um, so just opened it up. Oh, it's that past the parcel. <laughs> yeah, I think these are good. Yeah. What I'll have done is I'll put them in two different in two tubes and I'll have packed them like that. Alright, I'll just open these up and I'll show you before I house them up. Alright, just be a second. I'm not even taking the piss, this is past the parcel, that's one. And this is two. Really, there's no in it. <laughs> oh, I was taking the piss, there's another one. <sighs> Back in a second. Hello. So, yeah, why am I saying hello? It's the rest of the video. It's because I'm doing this a couple of days later. Um, so, I've housed up all these. Um, these are all marked as two centimetre, I think, or three. Yeah. Sorry, they're marked up as two centimetre, I think, and they're actually about three. Um... So yeah, I got two of each, and um, two Hapisha Harpactira, I don't know how you probably say it, my English isn't good anyway, not alone Latin. Um, so yeah, all these are perfectly, they are really awesome species, and I'll be honest with you, Spider Shop is selling one centimetre marks here, for £15, that's one centimetre, so in Spider Shop it'll probably be smaller than that. Radek or Tarantula World is selling two centimetre. These are actually free, give or take. Um, and they are cheaper. They are ten pound each. So if you're wanting any marks here, definitely go to Radek. Um, so the marks seem to have like a ready bum, reddish hairs on the bum. So that's one. And that's the other. Compared to the curator, which just seem to be an overall brownish colour. This one's actually malted. Oh, awesome. They're all quite leggy though, I'm going to be honest. But I'd say that's less leggy than that one. And then the marks here, that's less leggy than that one. So hopefully I'll have a male and a female each. I think Harpachira, I don't know how you say it, H marks here. H creator and the whole genus of dwarf baboons. I'm not too sure. I don't know much about the species. I'm going to be honest. Everyone goes mad over the pull cripes, but it's like, mm. I can get them cheaper than they're advertised anyway. But pull cripes, I'm not that interested in, to be honest. I can get one to two centimeters for about £60. But a lot of the places you'll see for around £120, um, which is crazy pricing. Um, but yeah, hopefully. It is a very nice genus. Hopefully, these will be male and females, and I'll hopefully breed them, so I can get um. So the, then there'll be more in the hobby. Cause these are the more uncommon ones. Marks seems to be second most um, not common but second most popular um compared to the others. Curator you don't really see generally. And there's also Curie peas, and I've seen Dictator before. All the other species I haven't actually seen in the hobby. At pull crap, so pull crap's marks a curator, curvy peas, and dictator. I've actually seen before, but the all the others I haven't. So, yeah, yeah and these all arrived perfect from Radek. As you have just mentioned, the pricing was perfect, as usual. From Radek, packed perfect, delivered on time for the first time, <laughs> and then posted for the day I requested. Um, Radek's a really nice guy to deal with, or Tarantula World, I would advise him to anyone. He's one of the first Tarantula deals I've actually dealt with, and I've constantly used him through the, throughout my time in the hobby. Um, he was actually the person I think I got my third and my fourth lot of Tarantulas off. Because I got like, Holof um, the only one that's actually passed away is a Holofelli Instant Gold, but um, that was a bad malt, but everything else which I've had, like a Nando Colorado Velosis, which is actually just freshly malted. She's a gorgeous female, absolute bitch though, I'm going to be honest, she's evil. Um, then we have like, I think we've got a Grand Sort of Pull Crouch from him, and uh, Freaks Palmer Octi, that was the first lot of teas I got from him. And 
obviously the Holocaust link to gold, but I ain't got that anymore. All the others are absolutely fine, healthy, and I've grown them on since tiny, tiny, well not tiny, like one centimetre slings, which is awesome. The collar right over low is actually a big female that I swapped. Mm. With my mature male Versi, which was huge. So yeah, he was one of the first dealers I actually dealt with, and Radek, I would advise to anyone, he's a really nice guy to deal with. Um, and he sorts out orders really quick. So literally they'll get back to you the same day near enough and he'll sort it out for you and post it out whenever. Whenever he's free really. He's a really nice guy and I wouldn't advise him to anyone. So yeah, good review as always from Tarantula World or Radek. Depending what he's trading as, he seems to change um, between the two. But yeah, he's the same guy and I would advise him to anyone. So thanks for watching people and send a bit. Bye. Moxie. Alright, so people, bye.